Hey guys, this is my Keisha comes to you from out of Chester and out here they call me the cake boss and this is my latest cake. This is for a baby shower and we have some initials at top on top that are made out of gum paste and I done them a week in advance so they can get very very hard and be able to keep it shape. So again, this is a baby shower cake and that's the baby's initials. So let's get started with telling you about the cake. The bottom tier is two 10 inch dirty ice sacks together and I covered it with the Wilton Blue Fondant. The middle tier is two eight inch dirty ice stacked together and I covered that with the same fondant. And I did my quilt and pattern, which in my previous videos, um, I do have a tool that makes the quilt and pattern a little easier. I'm gonna show you. It comes in two different sizes. So these little things right here will give you the quilt in. You have a large one and you have a small one. And what you do is you just hold it parallel to the cake and you push it in like so. But you want to cover your cake and as soon as you cover it, immediately you want to do that. You can't cover it put in the refrigerator and when it gets nice and firm then do it because it won't give you the imprints and I got that from creativecutters.com so if you guys want to purchase that it makes it very easy to do the quilt and pattern everything is um, nice and even nice and spaced I tried to do it myself with my my wilting tool but it didn't work out so got creative and found a tool the top tier is two six inch dirty ice stacked together and I just cover, finished covering that with the blue wheel fondant. Now, my gold pieces, um, they originally started off as a beige color and I just painted that gold with my edible um, paint and I mixed the edible paint which was um, a bronze color with some lemon juice and I came up with the gold we also have it up here and that's what I painted on the, the initials so and I did just get finished steaming it and this cake is very heavy I'm trying to turn it so I'm trying to get it back Again, guys, this is the Cake Boss coming to you from Chester. You guys can find me on Facebook at Cake Boss of Chester or JJ Sweet Tooth. You guys can shoot me a comment. Let me know what you think of my cake, guys. As always, thanks for the love and the support.